Hello everyone. Uh, another Minecraft video. Let's get it, gamers. Uh, so today, as you can see, we are in this uh, randomly generated village. And uh, today, I thought we might have a go transforming some of the houses here. Like this here. You see this house here? All you gotta do, all, 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 all you gotta do, Mojang and Four J. Is that? This is this. That instantly looks better. But obviously, you go that. Way. That. That. Two. But even that looks better. Than just blocks like it is on this side, and of course you do that the whole way through the house, and yeah. So like you see here, uh, this is what we call like an A-frame type thing. So an A-frame is where you build up like this in like an A sort of shape, but a lot of people just leave their A-frames. Uh, something like this and put blocks behind it or like even like this and just leave it like that like, there's nothing wrong with that I'm not saying there's anything wrong with that but to put more depth into your build what you can do is add a layer behind it and then add something like that obviously you need to do that on like a so even that looks better than just what it did before. So uh, I guess this is sort of like a building video, but at the same time it's not. I'm just uh, giving out a few things that if you wanted to make sure your Minecraft village looked better, then you could make it look better. So say this house here, okay. Now there's nothing wrong with this. This would be a perfectly fine starter house. I get that this is randomly generated obviously someone had to build this design or build this design but to make this better what we can do is just tear away this roof tear this roof away okay completely demolish this roof and once you have demolished most of the roof you can leave say that bit that sort of donutty type of rim with a hole in the middle. Now what you want to do is grab his, get some stripped out logs because that's what's here. Break, break and break them away too. Put them a layer that that way. Okay. Now when you've done that, do it on every side. Actually, even better would be to do it one out as well. Okay. And it's going to be the exact same amount of room on the inside if I'm correct but it's just going to make the outside look a bit prettier because you don't want to leave your house looking like a total mess do you? nah I thought not well, and if you said you did then you shouldn't, you shouldn't play minecraft with nothing else to say now I'm not going to change the overall design of this house of, as you still want to sit uh, it to be a village house but what you can do now is add this bit here in Okay, and then obviously this bit here, this bit here, this bit here. Do this on all four sides. Now moving on to the roof. If you want a similar style roof, which was just going into the middle as before, what I advise doing is this. Just replacing it with stairs. Okay, don't want to do it anything fancy. Just replace this house oh, with stairs all the way up to the very top and once I have done this I will show you what you can now what you can do next to improve this house I'm gonna leave it like that because I think that would look better uh, let's just have a look what would it look like with that now let's leave it like this now what you can do next is you may think this house is looking a bit weird now the cobblestone on the floor you, maybe that does look a bit weird if you don't like it 
going to change it to a more bright block, such as quartz pillars, maybe. Which sort of fits like a suburban type style. And then what you want to do is, if you've replaced it with that, get the same sort of materialized block. So in this quartz court stairs, place that there. Now you've got an entrance to your door. And of course, if you want the door to be lower, then of course you could do that as well. But for now, we're going to leave it up there. Personally, I'd put it on the lower platform, but it's up to you. Now what you want to do is when you've filled this in around the whole of the outside, or if you want to leave it like what it was, then you could do that too, obviously, but it's your choice. Now what you want to do is this looks a lot better than what it did. And, and uh, of course, I think I might add this in. Yes, because... Actually, no, because what I'm going to show you now is what you guys probably won't use for a chimney you'll probably use a campfire but what I'm gonna use is I'm gonna use the old technique of where is it this some of you guys probably know this already but if you do this with some stone and then just place some cobwebs down that looks like a chimney and there we go, there's some roof decoration done to me add a bit of extra don't know, just to add in some extra detail. And if you really wanted to to add some really fine detail, if you made this house a bit bigger, of course you can you can always add the windows in but better, but if you didn't want to do that, then what you could do is um get these stone pillars and then place them down the side like that but of course this doesn't really fit the style of a suburban house like I've gone for so I advise not using these if you want like a like a metal pole going down the side I, I would advise using iron bars to make it look like you've got uh, like a lightning rod or a drain or something like that as you see that looks a lot better than what this would on the suburban house of course this isn't a suburban house tutorial though yeah so uh guys i hope you enjoyed this video it's not really that helpful of a video i'm sure a lot of you guys already knew this of course it might look better like that it depends what you think but yeah i'm sure a lot of you guys didn't find this video helpful whatsoever but <laughs> course that's the point of it of course if i was to build an actual suburban house it wouldn't look anything like this if you want to see a suburban house tutorial i know these builds aren't like very good because it's just trying to base something off something else so it doesn't really look amazing oh wait another thing you could do just before we end the video that you could just do that or if you wanted to add depth into it get a block of oak which is there and then add that in there like that could do something like that to make it look a bit, bit better but that's going to be in the video guys uh, i hope you enjoyed and i will see you oh there's another village over there see you in the next video <laughs>